the equation for calculating cost of quality is COQ, cost of poor quality or COPQ, plus prevention costs, plus appraisal costs. Again we know that cost of poor quality or COPQ equals to external failure costs plus internal failure costs. So, ultimately we have the equation for calculating cost of quality is COQ, external failure costs plus internal failure costs plus prevention costs plus appraisal costs. The same challenges inherent in calculating cost of poor quality like loss of customer loyalty, loss of morale, loss of employees if morale remains low for extended periods, conflicts associated with scheduling or rescheduling, higher risks of compliance issues, including fines, and higher administrative costs also exist when calculating cost of quality. The same iceberg analogy for cost of poor quality, where most experts use the metaphor of an iceberg to explain the hidden costs of poor quality. On the surface, you see the very small tip of the iceberg, the obvious costs of poor quality. These might be things such as scrap, reprocessing, warranty claims, customer returns, and extra shipping. Beneath the surface, however, an iceberg is always much bigger. The same is usually true and relevant for calculating cost of quality also, and prevention and appraisal activities often have hidden costs such as unnecessary overtime, paperwork, or system expenses.